Welcome to Java Forum. Now I am going to show you how to install minimalistic JNU Windows W64 compiler and also I am going to show you how to compile and run C and C++ program on Windows 10 operating system. So this is a minimalistic JNU for Windows uh, website uh, W64 edition. So this is the latest version of um, Ming GW-W64. So these are the list of uh, tool chains available. So among that now I am going to install um, minimalistic GNUW builds. Okay. So go to the link. So this project is hosted in GitHub. So minimalistic uh, journey for Windows uh, W64 edition. So here I am going to uh, download a zip file for Windows. So this uh, I am choosing POSIX SCH UCRT. Okay, POSIX hyphen. SCH hyphen UCRT. So UCRT means Universal uh, C runtime for Windows operating system. So here you can see that uh, archive is get uh, downloaded. So I am going to extract the archive to one directory. Let me extract this archive. Yes, so extraction is completed. Now uh, let me go to C directory. So here you can see that Ming W64 directory is got created under that. This is the directory structure of minimalistic GNU for Windows 64 bit edition. So in bin directory, you can see a lot of exe files and uh, C and C++ compilers are also bundled in that bin directory. So rest of the directory contains uh, library and header files. Okay, now what I'm going to do next step is I'm going to add this uh, bin directory of MinGW64 to the Windows system path so that all the users can execute the C and C++ programs in command line. So advanced system, advanced uh, system settings, environment variable. So under uh, system variable tab, I'm creating, I'm editing the path variable. I'm editing the path variable. So I'm adding the minimalistic GNU tools bin directory to the path variable and also adding the entire directory to the system path variable. Yeah. So bin directory is mandatory. Okay, so I added the bin directory to the Windows system path. Now let me go to command line. So GCC hyphen hyphen version. Yes. So you can see that uh, latest GCC version is 12.2.0 is supported by current version of uh, minimalistic GNU tool. So G++ version that also you can see that 12.2.0. Okay. So uh, installation is correct. Now I'm going to show you how to compile and run C and C++ program using this minimalistic uh, GNU tool. Okay, so I'm having some programs. Uh, so 
this is the C program. C program uh, which is used to sort the array in ascending order, array of numbers in ascending order. Okay. So this uh, program is uh, based on bubble sort algorithm. Okay. This program is based on bubble sort algorithm which is used to sort an array. So this is the array containing some numbers. So I am I'm using two functions swap and sort function in order to resolve the uh, sorting sorting and ascending order program. Okay, so uh, I have saved the ascending dot c in C programs directory. Now I am going to command line. So d colon d colon C programs. So this is the syntax to compile the C programs. GCC hyphen O ascending dot ESC ascending dot C that's it so this will create one exe file so I am going to run that uh, exe file yes you can see that ascending order uh, program is got executed successfully so also you can see that exe is got created under C programs directory so we are uh, successfully compiled and uh, run the C program using minimalistic uh, GNU tools for Windows. So once again, I'm trying with uh, some more numbers. Yes. Yes. So now I have increased the uh, numbers in the array. Okay. Now next I am proceeding to C++ program. So same ascending order program only. This will sort the array of number in ascending order using C++ program. Okay. So now I am going to save the C++ program under D colon C++ programs directory. So ascending dot CPP. So I am using notepad as editor. So it will be very helpful for you. Notepad plus plus, sorry, notepad plus plus as editor. So this is a, a C++ program to sort an array of numbers in ascending order, okay? So now I am copying this directory path. So I am pasting in the command line. Yes. So now I'm now I'm going to C++ programs directory. Now I'm going to compile the C++ program. So this is the syntax to compile the C++ program. G++ iPhone O ascending.exe ascending.cpp. That's it. Now an exe will be created. Let me execute that exe. Yes. So you can see that ascending dot cpp is got executed successfully so finally we have compiled and ran the c and c++ program using minimalistic gnu tools for windows 64 bit edition so this uh, minimalistic uh, tool for uh, windows contains some basic tools basic c and c++ uh, compiler uh, 